Hello everyone, this is Captain Sobon. Welcome aboard the Starship and Normal Prize, and we are playing Pokemon the Gold version. Now, why are we playing this, you ask? Well, I got in the mood to play Pokemon, and I totally hit the wrong button, like I normally do on Final Fantasy. Anyways, um, yeah, my things... I still haven't ordered things for Super Mario 64 and uh, Donkey Kong Country, so we're going to play a game that's easy to play, which is Pokemon, because everyone loves Pokemon. <sighs> hmm? Wah! You woke me up! Will you check the clock for me? What time is it? Um... Let's see, let's make it... I guess, make it... No! No, it's gotta be 9pm! Because that's what time it is right now. What? 9pm? How many minutes? Um... 33? Is that lamp? What? 33 minutes? 9... 9.33? No wonder it's so dark! Hello! Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures that we call Pokemon, hence the title of the game. People and Pokemon live together by supporting each other. Some people play with Pokemon, some battle with them, all the fun, lead, lovey, dovey stuff that we all know and love. But we don't know everything about Pokemon yet. There are still many mysteries to solve. That's why I study Pokemon every day. Now, what did you say your name was? I never told you my name, man. Um, new name... Should we just go with the usual? Just put my name in. Um, that's not the mud I want. Delete you. Um, actually, no. Let's go with... Let's go with, hmm, Mochan. Yeah, that sounds like a good name. Our name's gonna be Mochan. Mochan, are you ready? Your very own Pokemon story is about to unfold. Your face, your, you'll face fun times and tough, dang, I thought he was talking about my face for a second, and tough challenges. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon, with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. I'll be seeing you later. Oh man, he shrunk me. Yay, we're in my bedroom. Awesome. Do do do. So I don't think there's anything I can interact with, right? It's a TV. Well, no, no freaking duh, dude. Is this a computer? Oh, Chen, turn on the PC. Oh yeah, we don't have anything to do. What about the radio? Professor Oak's Pokemon talk. Please tune in next time. Pokemon channel. This is DJ Mary, your co-host. Pokemon, Pokemon channel. It was a- No! No, I don't want to interact with it again. How are you now? That was weird. Ooh, what's the picture? It's the town map. Nice. That looks like a town map to me. What's up, Mom? Oh, Mochen, our neighbor, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said he wanted to do something for him. Oh, I almost forgot. Your Pokemon gear is back from the repair shop. Why was my Pokemon gear in the repair shop again? Did I run over it with something? Here you go. Mochen, receive Poke Gear. Oh, the repair shop is a paid uh, thingy of Poke Gear. I thought, like, who got in an accident and it was in the repair shop because it owed insurance or something. It's essential if you want to be a good trainer. Oh, the day of the week isn't set. You mustn't forget that, but I don't care about what day it is. Why do I have to put in what day it is? Uh, well, this is going to be posted on Friday and today's Wednesday, so I guess I'll keep it accurate since I made the clock accurate. Wednesday, is it? It is daylight savings time now. Um, I don't even know, honestly. Is February considered daylight savings time? I don't know. I'm just gonna say no. 9.37 p.m., okay? Alright, come to adjust your clock for daylight savings time. No, don't worry, I'll totally forget. By the way, do you know how to use the phone? Uh, yeah, I wasn't born in the cave, man. I'll read the instructions. Turn to- oh god dang it, I hit no, didn't I? 
Uh, turn the pokey gear on and select the phone icon. Phone numbers are stored in memory. Ah, just like computers. Just choose a name you want to call. Gee, isn't that convenient? Yeah, I mean, we have things nowadays that do all that on our own. I would say their names, but it'll pop up on my screen and be like, You say my name? I'd be like, no, I'm recording, go away. What do we have over here? Can I... What's in the fridge? Can I eat lunch right now? Dinner? Let's see what's in the fridge. Fresh water and tasty lemonade. I can't grab it? I want the water. Oh, I gotta stay hydrated, man. The sink is spotless. Mom likes to clean. Oh, that's good enough. Mom's specialty. Cinema Bar Volcano Burger. Ooh, that sounds, uh, intriguing. Hey, what's up, dude? Can I talk to you? Yo, Mochan! I hear Professor Elm discovered some new Pokemon. Oh yeah, duh, I have to go over there and get my starter Pokemon. Hey lady, you wanna go out with me? Wow, your Pokegear is impressive. I know, right? So is my heart. Did your mom get it for you? Oh, why do you have to say that? Come on, I was attempting to flirt with you. Why have to bring my mom into the conversation? Eh, whatever. What's this thing say? New Bark Town. Ooh, where's Old Bark Town? The town where the winds of a new beginning blow. Oh, do they blow to Old Bark Town? I want to know where Old Bark Town is. Oh, hey, what's up? Who are you? So, this is the famous Elm Pokemon Lab. What? What are you staring at? Jeez, rude much? All I want to know is what you were doing. It's trying to be friendly. Elm Pokemon Lab. Okay, I guess we'll go in here and get a Pokemon. What's up, Professor Elm? How are you doing today? Mochan! There you are. I need to ask you a favor. I have an acquaintance called Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got an email from him saying that this time it's real. It is intriguing, but we're busy with our Pokemon research. Could you look into it for us? Sure, why not? I'll give you a Pokemon for a partner. Yay! They're all rare Pokemon that we just found, conveniently. Go on, pick one. Okay. When I used to play this game all the time and when I was younger, I always went with Cyndaquil. I gotta figure out why my emulator keeps lagging and doing that, but whatever. So I might just stick with that tradition and keep Cyndaquil. I think he's the middle one. Oh, nope, that's Totodile. Do you want Totodile as the water Pokemon? Nope. Yeah, I know. I know which one I want. Be quiet, Elm. I know what I'm doing. Oh, of course, the one I don't select is the one I want. No, Chikorita is cool, but she's not what I want. I want Cyndaquil. You'll take Cyndaquil, the fire Pokemon. Yup. I think that's a great idea. Pokemon too. I thought he was going to say idea. Mochen receives Cyndaquil. Yay! Give a nickname to Cyndaquil? Nah, I'll keep him the same name. Maybe eventually I'll give him a nickname. Mr. Pokemon lives near Cherry Grove, the next city. It's almost a direct route to there. If your Pokemon is hurt, you should heal it with this machine. Alright, I might can take that machine with me though. Oh, here's my phone number. Call me if something comes up. Alright, cool, so apparently I just got this guy's phone number. Mochan got Elm's phone number. I don't feel like a stalker at all. Alright. What's up, dude? Mochin, I want you to have this for your errand. Mochin received a potion. Aw, oh, that's so sweet. He thinks about me. Mochin put the potion in the item box pocket. There are only two of us, so we're always busy. Yeah, you got a big freaking lab for only two people working at it. And I apologize about the lag, guys. Um, next episode, I'll try to figure out why, what's causing that. Um, is there anything else I can do with you, or are you just going to push me out like last time? Yep, it's just going to push me. Alright, screw you then. Um, I guess we'll head this way and start doing our mission. What's up, dude? Pokemon, hid, hide in the grass. Who knows when, they're, when they'll pop out? Oh, I know. The RNG gods decide that. Could have told you that, man. 
I love the music of this game. Ooh, who are you? What's up, buddy? No, I want to talk to you. Yo, how are your Pokemon? If they're weak and not ready for battle, keep out of the grass. You're so mean. How are they going to grow if they don't go in the grass? Tell me that, sir. Ooh, who are you? What's up, dude? I wanted to take a break, so I saved to record my progress. Haha, <laughs> you broke the fourth wall. Speaking of which, let's go ahead and break our fourth wall. I love how fast the old games save. Yep, that's not what I wanted to do, but I guess we're fighting something. The hoot hoot. Level 3 hoot hoot. Come on, Centaquil. We got this. Let's stare at him menacingly to lower his defenses. Because why the freak not? No! Okay, cool, he missed. Now, tackle him! Full force! Yeah! No, don't growl at me! Don't lower my attack, it's gonna take longer for you to die! Just die already. You better tackle me. I'll tackle you back. Nice. Yay, 24 experience points. Not bad. Kill we get one more of those, they'll level us up. Ooh. Hello there, lady. Whoops, I missed. What's up? See those ledges? It's scary to jump off of them. I just did that. But you can go to New Park without walking through the grass. Yep. I knew about that, lady. Thanks for telling me information I already knew. Yay, New Park Town. Um Yep, we have to keep going up if I remember. <laughs> Into the grass. Who? What are you? Route 30. Pilot City. And Cherry Grove City. Alrighty. And what's this tree have? It's a fruit bearing tree. Hey, it's Berry! Who knew berries grew up in fruit bearing trees? Obtain Berry. Yay! What's in here? Hello! You know Pokemon eat berries. Well, my Pokemon got healthier by eating a berry. Here, I'll share one with you. Awesome, I got two berries. Check trees for berries. They just drop right off. Yep, I just did that, sir. Alright, let's go ahead and berry give to... Oh, I didn't know you were holding something. Oh, apparently it was already holding a berry. <laughs> Whoops. Ignore that, I totally hit the wrong button. That was the Windows button, not the X button that was supposed to hit. Yay, I took a berry off of, off of Cyndaquil and gave him a berry. Because I am such a smart owner. Alright. Whoops. Come on, can we make it through? Yep. Sweet. Alright, what's in this, um, tree? Hey, it's... I forget how to pronounce that. But I think that cures paralyzes, if I remember. The pins... Pin... Oh, poison cure berry. <laughs> it cures poisons. Double check that, but I'm pretty... No, I said double check that. But I'm pretty sure that's what it does. Yep, self-cure for poison. Yep. What's this say? Mr. Pokemon's house. Yay! Hello, hello! You must be Mochan. Pro Professor Allen said that you would visit. You're right. This is what I want Professor Allen to examine. Mochan received mystery egg. Mochan put the mystery egg in the key pocket. I know a couple who run a Pokemon daycare service. They gave me that egg. 
I was intrigued, so I sent mail to Professor Elm. For Pokemon Evolution, Professor Elm is the authority. Even Professor Oak here recognizes that. He's like, You say my name. I heard Professor Oak. If my assumption is correct, Professor Elm will know it. Hello, Professor Oak. How are you doing today? Ah, so you're Mochan. I'm Oak, a Pokemon researcher. I was just visiting my old friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Wow, that's smart of you. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon? Yeah, you totally eavesdropped on our conversation, dude. You should know all about it. Let's see. Hmm, I see. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for this errand. Yeah, because I had to go through grass and Pokemon were attacking me. To researchers like Professor Elm and I, Pokemon of our friends. He saw that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Is it also because I wouldn't be able to survive if I didn't have a Pokemon? Because then the Pokemon would be like, Pidgeys, unite! He has no Pikachu! And we'd be like, ah, run for our life! Ah. Uh, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? Sure, why not? See, this is the latest version of Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Mochan received the Pokedex. Mochan. Man, I keep getting my character's name wrong. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But, I'll... But I've stayed too long. Okay, I, for some reason I thought there was a comma there. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Mochan, Mochan, I'm counting on you. See ya, Professor Oak. You are returning to Professor Elm, right? Here, your Pokemon should have some... rest. I only had one battle. I still have two berries. And a pelt potion that I got for free. I'm depending on you. What are you depending on me for? I... sorry, I, I was ranting. What are you depending on me for again? Yeah, whatever. Uh-oh. Hey, Professor Elm's calling me. Uh, hello? Mochan? It's a disaster. Um, uh, um, it's just terrible. What should I do? It's, oh, oh no. Please, get back here now. Alright, um, I'll come as quickly as I possibly can, but I'm not gonna walk so fast. Do, 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 do. Aw, didn't quite make it. What are we fighting this time? Ooh, a spin arc. Level 3, not too bad. We defeat this, it should level up Cyndaquil. Um, let's go ahead and tackle him to death. I didn't do as much damage as I thought. Good, he used String Shot, that was the one I was hoping he would use. Um, I don't really want to use Leer, because the fact he has Poison Sting and he could poison us, so I'm just gonna keep attacking him until he dies. Awesome. Stop shooting your strings at me! I don't care about your string shots. Yay! Yay, 23. Yep, level 6. Puts us up to 21 health, 11 attack, 11 defense, 12 special attack, 11 special defense, and 13 speed. Ooh, and we learned smoke screen. Cool. That can lower people's accuracy. Dude. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Mr. Pokemon's house. It's a bit further ahead. Oh, I already did that, so that advice was useless to me. Did I talk to you before? I don't remember. I battled the trainers on the road. My Pokemon lost. They're a mess. I must take them to a Pokemon Center. Uh, apparently you gotta train more, dude. Those guys are not that difficult. Uh-oh. Oh, hey, I remember you. You got a Pokemon at the lab? What a waste. It wimp like you? Don't you get what- don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Oh crap, I got Battle Dispersion? It's been a while since I played this. Hello. Unknown, what's the battle? Alrighty. Unknown sent out Totodile. 
Oh yeah, I forgot. This guy's gonna be my rival, I believe, after I beat him. And he always picks the one that's, you know, weak against you. So if you went with Cyndaquil, or um, Chikorita, he would pick Cyndaquil. If you went with Totodile, then he would pick, you know, the ones that are strong against it. Um, let's do Smokescreen. Lower his accuracy a little bit. What are you gonna do, Totodile? Oh, you're gonna lower my defense. Alright, that's cool. I'm gonna push you on the ground. Oh, that did like no damage. Oh, fine. You wanna have that battle? I can lure you too. No, no, don't scratch me. Why would you do such a thing? That did a lot of damage. Uh, smoke screen. Keep lowering his accuracy. Don't worry guys, that might have totally been a bad idea. Yep, because he scratched me again. Luckily, we have a berry! Alright, tackle him. God dang, Totodile, you have way too much accuracy. Ugh. Um... Luckily, we have lots of berries. Alright, we have enough health to survive one more scratch. Apparently this Totodile is, like, amazing with accuracy. Ooh, nice. Critical hit. Totodile use scratch. I think we have enough to kill him. I'm gonna take a risk. Yay! We did. Cool, because we got another critical hit. I did not want to die on the first the first uh, rival match. Yay, Syndical gained 70. That should be enough to level us up again. Yep. Sweet. That puts us to 23 health, 12 attack, 12 defense, 13 special, 12 special defense, and 15 speed. Unknown was defeated. Huh. Are you happy you won? Not really. I was about to lose my Cyndaquil. Ooh, and I got $300 for you beating me. I mean, for me beating him. Her. It. That person. My name's Unknown. I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Uh, wow. Thanks for pushing me out of the way, dude. I probably should have given him a different voice, but whatever. I was just reading it like I normally do. What's up, lady? Whoop. Well, I just ran away from you. Hey, dude. Oh yeah, I already talked to you earlier. I know shortcuts. I know shortcuts. There we go. <laughs> Press around my back. I heard a Pokemon was stolen here. I was just getting some information. Yeah, it was stolen from our rival. From Professor Elm. Apparently it was a young male with long red hair. Aw, he's male. Dang, I thought it was a girl. What? You battled a trainer like that? Did you happen to get his name? He did tell me my name, but I don't have it marked yet. Um, hmm. I gotta think of a menacing name for this guy. I'm gonna go with Kyle. I like that name. That's gonna be his name. So our rival's name is now Kyle. Okay, so Kyle was his name. Thanks for helping me invent my investigation. No problem, I totally made up his name. Mochan? This is terrible. Oh, yes, what was Pokemon, Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? Mochan handed the mystery egg to Professor Elm. This made me back up. But it is a Pokemon egg. If it is, it is a great discovery. What? Professor Oak gave you a Pokédex? Yeah, he trusts me, dude. Mochan, is that true? That that's incredible that I just got a Pokédex because it's part of the game? He is superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Well, I wouldn't be able to do anything if I didn't have a Pokédex. Wow, Mochan. You may think I didn't read all that. Takes to become the champion. You seem to be getting on great with Pokemon, too. 
You should take the Pokemon Gym challenge. The closest gym would be the one in Violet City. Mochan, the road to the championship will be a long one. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. Why do I have to talk to her? Then I get to get lectured by a virtual mom. I already get lectured by my real mom. Heal Pokemon? Yep. Heal or Cyntaquil. Mochan, use these on your Pokedex quest. Mochan, receive Pokeball. To add to your Pokedex, you have to catch Pokemon. Throw Pokeballs at wild Pokemon to get them. Mochan, put the Mochan, put the Pokeball in the po the ball pocket. Did he only give me one? No, he gave me five. For some reason, I was acting like he only gave me one. Hey mom, I'm going on a long Pokemon journey. Don't clean my room. I'll be back whenever. Wow, that's a cute Pokemon. Where did you get it? I found it randomly. So, you're leaving on an adventure. Okay, I'll help too. But what can I do for you? I know, I'll save money for you. Oh god. On a long journey, money is important. Do you want me to save your money? Eh, you might as well. You never know if I actually get knocked out. The only problem with doing this is after you get a certain amount of money, or a certain amount of money that she saves, she'll give you presents. Okay, I'll take your money. Be careful. Pokemon are your friends. You need to work as a team. Now, go on. Fine, just kick me out of the house already, jeez. It's like I'm all grown up. You wanna go out with me? Please? Come on, we can go on an adventure. You can go to Violet City and help me beat the bird gems. Alright, fine, whatever. Stay there and look at the poster. I've seen you a couple of times. How many Pokemon have you caught? Not even one. Would you like me to show you how to catch a Pokemon? Yeah, might as well. Screw it. Do it. Show me how to catch these bad boys. Wild Rattata appeared. No, no, you're not going to weaken it? Why would you just throw the Pokeball? The dude used the Pokeball. I just realized his name's Dude. That's awesome. See, you cheated. You're supposed to weaken him, then capture him. That's how you do it. If you weaken them first, Pokemon are easier to catch. Alright, let's see if we can catch something real quick. Let's see if we can get a Pidgey. Even though it's going to be kind of hard to do because it's the middle of the night. Hmm. Eh, screw it. We'll get a Hoodoot. Might as well. Alright. Let's weaken this Hoot Hoot a little bit. That actually helps me. Um, I like it when Hoot Hoots growl at me. Now I won't accidentally kill him when I tackle him too many times. That's fine, that's fine. Keep weakening the Hoot Hoot. Yeah. I don't really need to be this precise, but I like being precise. Let's hit him one more time. Awesome. Okay. Pack. Pokeball. Throw it at that Hoot Hoot. Go, Hoot Hoot, go into my ball. You know you want to be in the ball. Go into the ball. Good boy. Yay, we caught a Hoot Hoot. Hoot Hoot's data was newly added to the Pokedex. It always stands on one foot. It changes feet so fast, the movement can rarely be seen. Honestly, I always thought they just had one foot for the longest time because of this game. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know they were always standing on one foot until I actually seen the um, Johto series. I was like, oh, they actually do have two feet. They don't just are weird monstrosities. They only have one feet. Give a nickname to Hoot Hoot? Sure. We're going to go with the most legit name you can possibly think for a Hoot Hoot. <laughs> 
His name is now Birdie. Alright, let me go back and get everything healed and we'll call, call it an episode for the day. So this was fun. I actually really enjoyed um, playing around and playing old... Um, what is this? <laughs> Pokemon Gold version? <laughs> And, um, yeah, I, I honestly can't wait to continue this series. But, um, basically, yeah. Wow, my mind went blank. Why does that always happen? Basically, yeah, we we went to the, um, Mr. Pokemon, talked to him, he gave us the egg, we came back to Elm, Elm's lab gets robbed by the rival that we named Kyle. And um, we gave the egg to Elm, he was fascinated by it, and it gave us Pokeballs and told us to start our journey. That's pretty much what happened. So, <laughs> next time, um, pretty much the plan for the next episode is to get more Pokemon so we can build up our team and start heading to Violet City and continue training, honestly. Getting money, training, make our Pokemon stronger, and get ready to do the first gym battle. Gym battle. I don't expect to actually fight the next gym battle battle in the next episode, but one pro, the one following that. If I could talk, it would be amazing. But the one following that, we will hopefully fight the gym battle. Anyways, guys, till next time. This is Captain Soban signing out. <laughs>